This, 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 this show is brought to you by Safety FM. Well, it's Friday, so you already know this is going to be a Safety FM mini episode. You're listening to Safety FM Min. This episode of the broadcast and the podcast is brought to you by Safety Focus Moment. They're consultants that want to help you get the safety culture you've been looking for. For more information, go to safetyfocusmoment.com. Well, hello and welcome to Safety FM Mini. This is Jay Allen. I hope everything is good and grand inside of your neck of the woods as we are coming to you on this lovely Friday. So I was sitting around this week and, you know, hanging out, doing the things that I do. And I came to the realization that I am blessed enough that I have a group of peers that I am able to call, that I'm able to chat with and discuss things that come to mind that apply to this lovely world of ours, this world of safety. And I sat around and was thinking, how frequent or infrequent do you call people within your peer group? Do you sit around and schedule a time during the day, maybe once a month, once a week, once a quarter, where you call people that are in the profession, where you call people to have discussions with them about what's going on inside of the industry? I know at times it might sound kind of weird doing that, but it's always good to hear different perspectives from different peoples on what exactly is going on. I sit around all the time and have ideas and I can pick up the phone and call people from my contact list and have these kind of conversations. Or are you on the other side of the equation where you don't have anyone? Do you look at it and go, you wish you belonged to a peer group? And believe me, I'm not, I don't have, I don't have a magic wand at this moment where I can turn around and tell you, go right here and we'll be able to find it. If you don't have a peer group, what do you normally do? How do you look at this conversation? How do you have conversations with others about the things that are going on? If you don't have a group of people that you can depend on, where would you lean? I mean, there's all kinds of resources available online on peer groups that are out there. Different groups that have started, different groups that talk, even some, we'll say websites that have board listings on things that they do. Anyways, that's what I got for you on this Friday. Thank you for taking a listen. This has been the Safety FM mini episode. I've been your safety manager and host, Jay Allen. And until next time, be safe. The views and opinions expressed on this podcast are those of the host and its guest and do not necessarily reflect the official policy or position of the company. Examples of analysis discussed within this podcast are only examples. They should not be utilized in the real world as the only solution available as they are based only on very limited and dated open source information. Assumptions made within this analysis are not reflective of the position of the company. No part of this podcast may be reproduced, stored in a retrieval system, or transmitted in any form or by any means, mechanical, electronic, recording, or otherwise without prior written permission of the creator of the podcast, Jay Allen.